Hey guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do unbox the Huawei Y8P and this is a new mid-range phone from Huawei and guys I know that I am really late for the unboxing of the Y8P so without any wasting time let's see what is Huawei Y8P has we offer in this price range and guys this phone is costing around 38,000 PKR in Pakistan market and on the back we get a triple camera on the back and the main sensor on the back is a 48 megapixel and also we have a OLED display on this phone and this phone it is pretty interesting in this price range so without any wasting time let's quickly open this box i have to say and let's see what this huawei has you offer in this phone and guys this huawei is launching one variant of this phone that i have right now and guys this phone gave you a 128 gigabyte of internal storage with a 6 gigabyte of ram and the color i have is the breathing crystal color which is same as that we also get on the huawei y9s and guys we have a one year warranty card and you can see and guys also this phone give you a more improvement over the huawei y9s in some areas like the display quality it is much better and guys here is the one more seal now let's open this box and guys here is the huawei y8p now let's out the phone from this box and you can see here is the huawei y8p now i'm gonna just put the side here and look inside the box and guys we got this mini box which contain a simulation tool and also we got a quick start guide as well as a silicone case and you can see it is a soft silicone case that you are getting with the huawei y8p and you can see it is a soft silicone case and guys also we got some accessories with the huawei y8p inside of this box and guys we got this adapter and the pair rating on this adapter it is a 5 volt with a 2 ampere it is a 10 watt normal adapter that you are getting with the huawei y8p and also we get a usb type c cable which is a really good feature on huawei phones and you can see we don't get any micro usb cable right now with huawei phones as well and guys also we get the headphones and you can see and also get a headphone jack on this phone that here is the huawei y8p now let's out the phone from this plastic and you can see here is the huawei y8p and guys overall i have to say that the design language it is very similar to the huawei y9s now let's quickly board this phone up and you can see again these are the main highlight feature about this phone we have a 4000 mh battery size and also we get in display fingerprint scanner and also we get a OLED display on this phone and on the back we get a 48 megapixel AI triple cameras on the back let me rem remove that and guys now let's quickly show you the physical overview of this phone on the bottom we get a speaker USB type C port as well as a main microphone on the left hand side we get a sim tray you can use one micro SD card with a two nano sims at the same time and guys on the top we get a headphone jack as well as a noise cancellation microphone on the right hand side we got a volume up and volume down rocker with a power on off button on the front we got this display and it is a OLED display now let's quickly set up this phone up and guys here is the first boot of the Huawei Y8P and you can see and guys this phone give you a 6.3 inch full HD super AMOLED display I have to say it is a it is a OLED display and guys also this phone gave you a in display fingerprint scanner and you can see and it is the optical in display fingerprint scanner but the speed of this in display fingerprint scanner it is really good on this phone and guys also we get a 4000 mh battery size and guys on the back we get a triple cameras on the back and the main sensor on the back is a 48 megapixel then we have a 8 megapixel ultra wide and a 2 megapixel for depth sensor and the camera performance it is really similar to the Huawei Y9s and also we get Huawei Kirin 710F chipset which is not the best chipset in this price range at least we get a new Huawei Kirin 810 chipset that we also see on the Huawei Nova 7i now let's go to the settings and go to the about phone this phone it is running on Android 10 which is the latest software version of Android and guys also we get a 128GB of internal storage out of 113.56GB it is available for you guys and now let's go back and now let's go to the display area and guys also we got a auto brightness feature on this phone and guys also you can change the screen resolution from full hd to 720p and now let's look at the camera and guys on the back we got a triple cameras on the back 
and the main sensor on the back is the 48 megapixel and guys by default the ai it is off on this phone and i use most of the huawei phones in ai mode and you can see here is your ultra wide you can see ultra wide it is also looks really good on this phone now let's go to the video section and let's see the video recording size and guys also we get a 60 fps option on this phone and you can see you can record full HD with a 60 fps video recording with the back camera and guys you can see that in the more section you also get these features like HDR as well as slow-mo on this phone and guys and the portrait remote is also work on object I have to say which uses a 2 megapixel depth sensor on the back and guys also we get a night mode which is only available with the normal lens in the front camera it is coming at 16 megapixel and the front camera also give you a portrait mode and you can see and the night mode it is also available with the front camera that's a pretty good thing on this phone now let's see the video recording size with the front camera especially only shoot full hd with a 30 fps video recording size we don't get any full hd 60 fps video recording with the front camera and guys overall i have to say that this phone gave you a 4000 mh battery size with a huawei kirin 710 f chipset as well as a 6.3 inch full hd oled display i have to say that the battery size it is a little bit smaller on this phone at least we get a 4000 and 400 mh battery size on this phone nowadays we also get a 5000 mh battery size in this price range but that's about it and thank you so much for watching this unboxing and my first impression regarding the huawei y8p let me know your thoughts in the comment section below do you like the huawei y8p and guys also this phone does not give you any google play services and you can subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and let me know what kind of more videos that you guys want to see regarding the huawei y8p and i will see you in my next video peace out